Jeremy Clarkson says that Nigel Farage is entitled to his own opinions as he defends the broadcaster following his expulsion from the private bank, Coutts. Jeremy Clarkson has defended former UKP leader, Nigel Farage amid his ongoing drama with Coutts and Co. The ex-top peer presenter has said that Nigel, 59, had been expelled from banking with a private finance manager because he had become a victim of weepy woke warriors who tend to play the offended card. In his latest column for The Sun, Jeremy, 63, stated that despite not caring much for the politician, he firmly believes that he is entitled to his own views. He said, Bosses have their hands tied by weepy woke warriors who wield enormous power because they can play the offended card. They can't be sacked and they can't be ignored. I don't much care for Nigel Farage. I was passionately opposed to Brexit and find some of what he says head-swiveling annoying. He offends me greatly, he continued. But he is entitled to hold and share his views, and if he turns up one day at my farm shop, I'll be happy to sell him some sausages. The comments from Jeremy came a day after the 59-year-old had received an apology himself from Kaut's parent company, NatWest. As per Sky News, the chief executive officer of NatWest, Alison Rose, wrote to Nigel and offered him an apology. In the letter, she said that deeply inappropriate comments had been made against the British broadcaster, which did not reflect the view of the bank. Alison also said, I believe very strongly that freedom of expression and access to banking are fundamental to our society, and it is absolutely not our policy to exit a customer on the basis of legally held political and personal views. In the letter, the chief executive also revealed that the bank would be commissioning a full review of the Cout's processes for how these decisions are made and communicated. The purpose of this investigation is to ensure that NatWest provides better, clearer, and more consistent experience for customers in the future. It has also been reported that NatWest has now offered Nigel alternative banking arrangements. Speaking to reporters, Farage said that it is always good to get an apology, but felt as if it was ever so slightly forced. It also felt a bit like, not me gov, he added.